Hi, in this video we're going to have a look at how you can use formulae in an iDocio gradebook um, to calculate things. So um, I've got a, a gradebook set up here with some match data and I've got the number of appearances made by these uh, football players over here and the number of goals that they've scored. Now what I want to do is I want to work out how what what the goals per game ratio is so how many um, goals per game these players are scoring so i'm going to create a calculation in order for, um, for me to do that so i'm going to do that by clicking on this plus sign over here um, and that's going to bring up a menu and i'm going to click on add calculation now the calculation i'm going to add is going to be a formula so I'm going to click on formula over here and, and that's going to bring me this menu over here. So I'm going to start by labeling um, the column. So I'm going to click on column over here um, and I'm going to give the column a header. So I'm going to call it um, goals per game. Okay, and then I'm going to click back on formula over here and um, and I'm going to create a formula that's going to tell me what the goals per game is. So um, over here um, I've got my goals data and my appearances data um, so I'm going to click on goals and I'm going to divide that by the number of appearances. Okay so I've got the goals divided by the number of appearances and if I click save um, that's going to that's going to tell me what the goals per game ratio um, is. Now, um, this is now going to be live um, and it's going to relate to these values here. So, for example, if I change um, Alexis Sanchez's goals to 100, um, you should see that his goals per game ratio um, has now changed to 1.82. Okay, so I'm just going to put it back to um, 25. Okay, so that's how you can use the uh, formulae function in iDocio. I'm sure you'll agree that it's a really powerful thing uh, that you can now do. It's actually quite new, so I'm looking forward to having a bit of a play around with this myself. Okay, thanks very much. See you next time.